Hello Katie, hello Morgan. Today I thought I'd tell you about my love of old things. Now, my love of old things has never actually had a an inception, if you would say, as you would call it. I've had a love of old things forever. And my love of old things often comes from my dad being old and him collecting old things and his love for old things. So I guess, I guess my first statement was incorrect. My love of old things inception was my dad and my birth. Yes, so not talking about birth. This is my dad's. It's an old typewriter. And there's a reason I love typewriters. It's because it's not a computer. And I don't really know why I love this thing. And it doesn't really work. The ink is running out. The keys are busted. It's loud. There's no real reason for me to keep it since I already have a computer. I have a better computer. I have a computer that can use the backspace. So why would I need this? Well, the truth is I wouldn't. But why do I want this? Because it reminds me of a time where things weren't all digital. And that also leads me into my next thing. What are your thoughts on like digital copies, like like uh, Ellen Hardcastle, how one person asked, will it be in stores? And Hank said, no, 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 no. It would only be down able for download or by mail. And there's a reason for that. There's a reason I don't like that, because one, what if your iTunes screws up? Well, suddenly you don't have a CD that you can help. But another thing I find, and this is according to books, is, it's maybe a bit creepy, but I really enjoy the smell of books. I really enjoy the look of books, the feel of books. That telltale knock. And when you go to a bookstore and you find a decent Harry Potter book that was pre-owned. And you got for about $17 instead of the 35 And I think if I had to be born at any time in period, any time in human history, I would be born in the 1940s. Because that is, I am a 40s person. I enjoy records. I enjoy old cars. I enjoy old costumes, like zoot suits. Zoot. Salute to zoot. Except for the zoot suit riots. Look it up. It wasn't pretty. And basically, I think that this typewriter here was a testament to human history and literature. Now, I have one question to ask you two. If you had to be born at any time, when would you be born? And where would you be born? And also, Katie, I know what a Dalek is. I know I can use Wikipedia. I may not watch Doctor Who, but I can still look things up on the internet.